I gave you a moment and you, you sort of acknowledged them. What, what, what was your, your emotions during that time? What, what was that moment like for you? Uh, it was cool. You know, uh, I, don't know, I knew it was going to happen at some point. It's kind of, you start, it's kind of impossible to not catch seven more passes over four games. So I knew it was going to happen, so I've been thinking about it and stuff. I just kind of wanted to do it here, you know, because we're at home and stuff like that. And, you know, it would been cool. It's getting kind of skeptical about it in the first half. I have, I don't think I caught one in the first half. I might have one. So I was kind of like, you know, it's like, let's just get the win, I guess. And then, uh, because River was having a, a really good day, so we just, we just kept feeding him. And then he went down, so I'm good. He had to, we had to figure it out. So it worked out, it was cool. Something I've, I've really been wanting to do for a long time. You knew it was coming for a long time, but in that moment, uh, what did it feel like? Uh, I mean, nothing all like, you know, I wasn't feeling all blushy and stuff. You know what I mean? and, like all romantic and anything. It was cool. I mean, I, I appreciated uh, the cheers from the fans and everything, the acknowledgement for it, you know what I mean? <clears throat> Did you know that touchdown pass when you caught it that that was the record game? Mm -hmm. You have the football, right? Mm -hmm. No, I gave it back to the ref. I don't have it. No, I'm joking. Yeah, I took it. <laughs> he was asking me, he was as I was running off with the ball. I looked at one ref and I was like, no. And I was running, and the other ref was like, ball, ball. I'm like, no, it's my ball. And I just ran off the field. Like, I was with my teammates and everything. They don't know. I mean, they got a bunch of stuff going on, so you just gotta be like, you know, no. Nice to get it on a touchdown. I mean, does that make it? I mean, I would have took it on anything, honestly. But uh, I was, I was uh, trying to get him just throw me like a little screen or a hitch or something just so I could get it. But this is a lot more uh, poetic, I guess. It works, but it works out better as a story. Going forward, you don't have that to chase anymore. Is it? Is it about? Uh and making it a really tough record to break. What, well, uh, the cat, the cat, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> it's about just winning the games now, you know what I mean? Kind of done everything that I can do in my reach. So, you know, hey, just keep you guys, trying to catch touchdowns and put some points up, you know? Did you guys know during the middle of the game that the Huskies have lost the USC? Did you guys hear that? No, I saw it there. It was earlier, before we, came, before we started or whatever. I yeah, was in like 17-3 or something like that. But, you know, we're not really worried. We weren't really worried about it. We had to play a football game ourselves. So, I guess the high-powered offense, show, you know. We got our own thing. We're going on here. We don't got time to be checking out everybody's score around the world, you know what I mean? But the fact that you guys now leave the pack call, does that give you a little bit more motivation for next week against Colorado? Not more motivation than we had this week. I mean, what are we, 8 no in the pack? Or 7, is that 8? 8? 7 and all that. You know, now we want to be 8 no. You know, that'd be cool. You know, it's all working right now. We're just going to try to ride the wave. You know, keep going. You mentioned Rivers' performance tonight. I mean, what has he meant to you know this team this year? Uh, a lot. He catches a lot of passes for us. You know, he has his, he has his own uh, situation going on when, with all the catches he's got and everything. He's got his own respect due over there for him. So he has to, he's someone that has to be reckoned with when he's on the field. He makes our offense work better because. He could just occupy the middle of the field if they're not gonna if they're gonna try to cover the outsides, then you know he dominates pretty and then vice versa when they try to start covering him up then I'm able to do my job a lot easier too. So it's kinda we got a, a marriage. How is he and did you say anything to him when he came off the field? That's, uh, that's a question for coach. He's great. He's great. Exactly, exactly. You've heard it all before.
You mentioned that River and the inside receivers help the outside receivers. How much does the run game also help your offense? Oh, it helps a lot. I, I, I don't like to admit it sometimes because, you know, the run game affects, you know, my life. But it's affected my life in a good way now. You know what I mean? Back in the day, we just run it and nothing would get done. And it was like, just don't run it. You know, just throw me the ball. We can get more yards if you just throw the ball out here than if we run it. But now they're having to do like eight, eight yards a carry or some crazy stat. And <clears throat> it's hard to deny that type of production, you know. So I just, you know, just roll with it, you know. Everybody's feeling pretty good after the games, you know what I mean? Everyone's healthy because we're spreading the ball around and everyone's taking turns carrying the load a little bit. So it's a good deal. Balance is good. We got some good balance. Right now, this is probably this is probably so heart wrenching for Coach Leach that we have such good balance right now. He probably can't deal with it. They're probably they're probably making him run the ball or some some. Uh, Given where you guys were at two and four years ago, just how nice is it to be sitting up there, first place mid November? It's better than sitting in last place in the middle of November with nothing to play for. That's that that would suck. You know, we've been there. So this is cooler than that, you know. It's better than being in second place, you know. I don't know. You know, you, you've won something before. You've been in first place before. I haven't. That's a lot. That's a lot. Never. Has anybody won something before in here? You, you guys know what first place feels like. It's a good feeling, but we haven't won everything yet, so we got to keep going, you know. It doesn't really matter. It's all just like... You know, just stuff in the air until someone gets a trophy. It's just something that you guys could talk about. It's like, oh, they're in first place. And then, you know, it's like, they lose, and it's like, okay, now we're back to where we were just at, you know?